I've had a blast so far. Um, I've learned a lot of things, a lot of teamwork. There's a lot of teamwork involved here. Um, we have to do a lot of drill and ceremonies, but it's all worth it towards the end where we get to graduate and, and soon hopefully be staff and do the same thing that these guys are doing. My highlight has probably been um, doing a bunk with my team in a minute. Uh, we had to make a bed with every, we had to do all our pillows and sheets and stuff in a minute. And we had to work together and we did it. And yeah, it was all teamwork. I definitely have noticed I am, have a lot more discipline. I used to just not have any respect for authority or other people at all, pretty much in general and Civil Air Patrol has really changed that and made me a better person. If you want to be a better person and better yourself and other people and serve other people, I would say join Civil Air Patrol. So this is my third encampment. Uh, I basic in 2018. In 2019, I came back as a flight sergeant and now I am here as a flight commander in 2021. Personally, myself, it's had a huge effect on just what I know I can accomplish with myself. I can do better with other people. I can help lead others, help solve problems. The virtues you learn, integrity, volunteer service, excellence, and respect, they help you in just about every aspect of your life, and that's a lot of what I like. Also, I really enjoy wearing the uniform. I was a cadet from 1995 until uh, 20, 2000. Um, and after that, I went into the United States Air Force and I, I was an, a weather forecaster for 18 years. And all of that experience was because of all of, the, all of that I got out of this program back in the late 90s. Now, I'm one of a few dozen enlisted aviators at uh, Grand Forks Air Force Base flying the RQ-4 Global Hawk. And I attribute all of that to what I was doing here 20 years ago. Um, drilling on a field, coming to those encampments, um, all of the excesses I've had. If you have any love of aviation, of meteorology, of um, <laughs> science, technology, um, this would be a great program for you. Uh, you get out here, you learn leadership, you learn teamwork, you get to do exciting things, go through obstacle courses with your team, and learn how to um, give back to your community as well. Civil Air Patrol has a, a tremendous amount to offer. Um, you get exposed to a, a lot of different things that you're not going to be exposed to. Um, the cadet program, which we, we model the Air Force uh, rank structure. Uh, cadet comes in as a, a cadet basic. They go up through the NCO ranks, becoming uh, a staff sergeant or a technical sergeant, uh, a sergeant major. And as they progress through the ranks, they're given more and more responsibility. So it allows you to develop a lot of those um, leadership skills, a lot of those teamwork skills, a lot of those time management skills that are important later on in life. The second part is aerospace education. Um, we, we develop future aerospace leaders. We allow cadets to learn how to become pilots. We have the largest uh, single engine fleet of aircraft in the world. Um, there are a number of different squadrons that are located all around the country that have uh, both pilots and uh, pilot trainers that are able to take the, and take that information that they have and transfer it to our young people. My personal experience at Encam and I just had a, an absolutely blast. I was able to fly in a Black Hawk helicopter. Um, we were able to do some different things that really brought us together. And, and my friends today are all Civil Air Patrol people. So we look back 25 years later, um, I don't have friends from high school that I went to. But all of my friends that I, that I have to this day that I've had all this time are people I met at 14, 15, 16 years old through the Civil Air Patrol. 